In this video, I will tell you what's new with Flutter 3. First, Linux and macOS is now in stable version, which means everything is now ready for production. Because of that, they had to create a brand new Flutter widget. And this one is the platform menu bar created for macOS. It will allow you to control events from the macOS application menu. It's always cool to have new widget, but the next thing we will talk about is way better. And it's about Material Design 3. We have now access to Dynamic Color Scheme. If you want to create a Flutter app with the Material Design 3, Three, I will add in the description how to create this application. Now let's talk about Firebase and Flutter. It's now easier than ever to integrate Firebase within your Flutter app. The Flutter Fire UI package is perfect for that because it provides developers with reusable UI for authentication and profile screens. Another thing they just added is a Flutter game template. And this one is absolutely insane because they added inside the code the in-app purchase and mobile ad SDK. If you want to download the Flutter game template for the in-app App purchase code or mobile ad SDK code, I will add everything inside the description. Another cool thing is Flutter now enable adding anything to the material library theme data. This means you can customize your color names and everything that go inside the theme data. I think Flutter 3 is absolutely insane. But you know what is even more insane? 35 Flutter tips that will change your life. I'm not joking, these tips are very good. So click on this video and I see you in the next one. Bye.